Hello, I'm Satoshi Yamamoto. Welcome back to my time bench. Uh, today, I'm going to tie this very, very simple and sparse soft tackle uh, that I learned from my guide mentor, Montana's master angler himself, Tom Travis. I cannot emphasize how effective and how important you know this pattern is. You know, and then uh, I'm going to show you two different styles well it's basically the same type but uh, different purpose uh, or of use so well let's get started okay uh, when I fish on the film on the water film remember I said on the film okay <laughs> and then uh, I'm going to use uh, this uh, emerger hook um, uh, Daiwiki Dai 125, what I got here is size 16, or Montana Fry 7125, TMC 2488. Uh, it's all, you know, uh, uh, Emerger and YX short hook. I'm using a uh, light olive 8 0 thread key. I even stop just at the point of this short, you know, uh, hook. Oh, I got already got one here. Um, uh, Taki Biots, light olive, PMD color. Stop that. Just a tiny bit of dubbing. I'm going to use just this uh, uh, hairline dub. Just a tiny bit. I said on the film as if you are fishing this on the dry fry. Then again, I could I, I can say that uh, you can fish this. Um, you can fish this, you know, as if uh, uh, with a typical, you know, soft tackle swing. Very tiny dub here. Okay, I'm going to use a uh, partridge here. Partridge, yeah. So, have one. Uh, this one from the neck. Very kind of intermediate color. Tying. Spring loaded hackle pyre. Barely two tons. We finish. I don't think these hakus are too long, you know, in my duka, or no, I don't think so. This is just about right, you know. 
okay um, since it's so simple don't take time I like to show you another uh, style well let's make a commercial break uh, I'll <laughs> make sure the camera is focusing here okay uh, it's that the same time but this time I'm going to use this uh, scud hook which is uh, pretty much the same style same you know of the hook same shape of a uh, 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 like a major hook but uh, compared to a light wire the major hook it's almost like a you know uh, 3x strong I guess so and then also might as well use a different color uh, I'm going to tie with some uh, uh, rusty dumb basically a gray okay why um, I use this is because that uh, I want um, I want fish in the film, you know, or below the film, you know. I want this uh, soft taco to sink, you know, gently, you know. That's why I use a slightly heavier um, um, hook. Okay, uh, uh, gray, Adam's gray, um, um, Taki Biotes. Just about here. I might as well use this uh, mascot for just a tiny bit, maybe this much. I have no guard here. Key. You know, uh, I can. I like to use partridge, you know, partridge always works, but also what I got here is another really good looking soft taco material. It's a uh, Coq de Leon hand cape. Very gorgeous material. Two tons, very simple. So, uh, this is a second idea, you know, now I tie this, you know, with a heavier hook, basically. Then again, combination of colors, I got a PMD, light olive, gray, dark olive for blue-winged oli uh, blue, uh, blue olive, uh, I have a sulfur, you know, which is a bit uh, orange, creamish, you know, tacky belts, and then, you know, all kinds of dubbing, um, and the hook size. Uh, for this carb hook, uh, size 16, even 16, uh, 18, 20, even 22, you know, then uh, heavy wire, light wire, light wire emerger hook, combination, um, um, then uh, uh, weight to fish is just uh, uh, 
uh, there is no limit you know it's totally up to your imagination so uh, get some tied up and then uh, 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 go fishing and then uh, uh, this fly should work pretty much anywhere and then again yeah uh, if you happen to visit uh, spring creeks in uh, Livingstone uh, this is one of uh, uh, master flies you know so uh, thank you for watching and then uh, have a nice day